Okay. So today I'm working on a fast trip. Let's see if I can keep up with talking and finish this video. I had to take off the original tire and put this new tire that I got from Dillinger. Dillinger. It's a 700C tire and it's the same size as the 29 inch SE uh, fast ripper tire. From there I put a little bit of air in there that way I can have some, uh, some type of air pressure in the tire while I'm working on this. I put the brake rotor on there also and then uh, I had to fit the axle to go into the dropouts on the front fork. I figured out that the nuts, once I tried to hand tighten them on there, wouldn't go past a certain point on the front forks. So I had to grind that part off. All I did was took a marker, grabbed my grinder, and then grinded that little, uh, little part off, the little edge, and then uh, the wheel fit right in there. Um, after I put the wheel in there, I tightened up the nuts, and then I started routing the wire. Um, I was looking for zip ties there, though. I started, I just zip tied the first um, wire onto the, the side, the uh, front fork, and then I just followed it up. I just set the bike up there, that way I can work on that. From there, I put the, uh, the holder for the battery onto the, uh, the, bottom, uh, the bottle bottle holder spot right there. That pulls it on there. I continue to route the wires up. That's the screen. The screen attaches using two screws that loops open uh, the loose knife right there in the front. There's also a throttle on that side. You have to take the grip off so you can slide the throttle on the and tighten it up. Uh, I got my grips a little bit stuck because I pulled them off inside out and caught hell trying to get them back on. Um, I just hit with my hot water and get them soft so I can get them on the um, after that, I just finished uh, routing the wires. Um, I was lifting up to make sure that the wheel was spinning properly and that the uh, rotor wasn't uh, rubbing on the brake portion. Uh, after I checked it, I just uh, did a little, a little quick ride to make sure it was working. Um, I'm going to bring it back over to make the little final adjustments on the front with the uh, zip ties so I can um, route the wires a little bit neat. Uh, after I finish routing the wires, that's pretty much it. The battery was already charged up and once again this is a Dillinger kit. A Dillinger um, uh, Street Legal 700C kit. And it's on a Mike Buff Fast Ripper. And it works. It's a 36 volt battery. I actually rode it about 13 miles so far. And I still haven't seen the battery charge. So this is actually a pretty cool 